I know that that's a really hard movement, and we work on it all the time. But it's it's a rolling of it. It's a rolling of the hands. So it's not this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know that it's a technicality. Um, but um, a lot of the initial um, Hawaiian steps were done um, for men um, as training for um, war. So they would do these as their calisthenics in their training. So um, the, one, the one that you talk about doing last and right is called kahalo. And so um, what we, we just go, go back and forth. Yeah, everybody do that. <laughs> so, um, I, so, basically, so basically, it's just a step, touch, step, touch thing. So it's step, touch, step, step, touch, step, touch, thing. Just back and forth. That's a, a hella. And so when you you can do that when you're doing your movements, but you always lead, lead, and follow your head to the to the hand to the direction that you're moving, and your hands don't cross this way. You have to use an imaginary line, like for your cross arm movement. So this is good for cross arm movement. They stay up at your chest. At, please don't be offended, but if you say this, you're a mama. <laughs> your nene. Right here. They stay right there, okay? So they don't cross like this. So they, they stay here. So I know I'm not mirroring you. We'll start this way so I can mirror you. But you just go to the left and look with your hands touch and then back over. And you just sway your hips back and forth. You don't dip your shoulders. It's not this. <laughs> it's not that. 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 That's hella, but I don't know that the kids would be able to get that, but it's it's stepping like this. This is a, a marching step. And you're seeing I'm not moving my shoulders. I'm just moving my hips. And you go down. You're very low. It's very, you're working your core there. Yeah. <laughs> and your quads. See, we have hula in Missouri. It's a lot of hula. But, so I don't know that you guys would do that much as much as you do the kahalo and um. But I thought the other I mean, one. Put it on and let's see what. No, I don't. Yes. But the, what, what I thought would be fun of the kids would like is called an ami, and it's where you're actually. And we all have um, we call uh, our um, our uh, our skirts and stuff on. So you're actually you're keeping your shoulders. See, and I get out of breath because it's it's a hard workout. But you're just you're moving back and forth like this. <laughs> So you're moving it. It's a, it's a, it is core workout. I should be really skinny. <laughs> <laughs> but you're just moving back and forth like this. Oh, you're, and you're squatting. You're not really picking up your toes no, at all. You don't. You don't pick up just your heels a little? You're just no. heels. You're really not supposed to even pick up your heels there. Oh. You're supposed to stay. Oh, Are you circles or just back and forth? Circles. Yeah. It's a circle like this. Like a yeah. Yeah. Like a so I think that would be good for the kids to do during that time that they could do. They could do the kahalo back and forth. And then you could find in the middle where they could circle. If you want to really get fancy, they can circle. <laughs> and so that would kind of be like the little walk when we're talking about coordination and balance. So fours and fives, that would, did you see what I did? Yes. And the cuddle, or the ami while you're moving. So it kind of be like the wiggle walk when we're talking about coordination and balance. So to the other ones, they could, they could spin. You'll do it. You can go back the other way. But you have to be spinning while you're moving. So well, let's put it on and see what I <laughs> 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 I don't know.